Hi all, welcome to today's market opening report and as we expected there is a slight bearishness in the market. I think uh, even I expected uh, yesterday to be a, based on the yesterday price action, I expected it to be a flat normal day but uh, since I am hedged my portions so did not do anything even on the uh, last two days views I have shared for the next two to three days my view is very simple. So small risk on the downside. I am expecting somewhere here market to come. Once it comes here, I may be initiating my shot. If not, just let it down with a very small risk. So, even though my view, so even uh, we said for the Nifty, even we said the levels will be like 16,200 and for the Bank Nifty, the long term support I uh, expected is around 34,000. So, even 100 point cushion, you can add it on the downside. So, uh, here you can. Uh, at 200 points, so 33,800 to 3400 is the long term support. You just open your higher time frame chart and then look into the chart. So from here on, yes, market is on the sell mode, but if you are a seller now, you do not have any room for the target. So with that, I am not jumping into the sell, I am just waiting for some kind of retracement levels, though it is not coming, uh, but maybe still we have 3-4 uh, days for the expiry if at all if there is any bounce and if the data shows again the bearishness i will be trying to jump somewhere in this levels so what i mark it as kind of resistance otherwise i am not going to trade for the next two to three days this is what i have been saying from uh, right now from last thursday to friday once the expiry was over so my view was i just kept it like that because going short even though market is showing uh, bearish portions, but looking at the room for the target, I do not expect uh, uh, much room here, but uh, because of the global queues, markets are coming like slightly going down and down and moreover if you look at VIX, so today VIX is up 5 percent, that means it is trading above 22. So again, uh, the market is quite volatile enough and looking at price action of the previous trading day, so for the Friday uh, institutional data, so FII. DII kind of modulus if you do it is down so it is more than net outflow of 2000 point. So looking at the market structure and DII so I am not looking only at the FI number I just consolidate and I use either a net flow or inflow uh, based on that I used to predict. So what I am expecting is uh, might be in one or two days market will try to bottom out but I am not expecting huge reversal but I am expecting a small Though I am expecting low, but I expect it to be a lower low unless and until these last two swings are not taken out, I will be still going as a shorter. So that is what uh, my view is and moreover, uh, and now you just concentrate on the price and moreover just concentrate on the targets what you are getting on the direction of the cell. So what I am expecting is looking at the volatility, if there is a small bounce, what I am expecting is you can just look at the ATM schedule of the nifty or bank nifty for the current week itself. So it seems to be like one leg of small up move can come more than 1000 points. So I do not want it to short here and get trapped here only. What I am trying is yes I am doing a contract trade but ensure that your risk is something like this. Do not keep your risk open and then do not blame the market for okay it is going on keep on going I never seen market like this. So always avoid that kind of stuffs. So what I am expecting is maybe by today or tomorrow I am expecting a kind of short term bottom formation even on a higher time frame chart. So I wanted to get positioned myself for that view. So I think for the day uh, looking at because we need to look at the data this is the first day of the week uh, for the current week and moreover globally everything was down. Uh, so we just need to see the data point of view. So how you are going to check the data very simple market is giving pressure in this direction. Concentrate on the P buildups. So once you get a good confirmation of the market is going to hold based on the data point of view, then think about adding long. But even if you get an idea of adding long, ensure that your risk is very small and it is fixed even if a market drifts further 2000 point to 3000 point. So that is the advice from my side for the day. Maybe at the end of the day we will see if there is any data confirmation or if there is an 
uh, price reversal confirmations like strategies uh, uh, kind of uh, uh, divergence in the higher time frame if at all if it is there i will keep you updated in the telegram channel so keep watching us and maybe that's it for the day hope you enjoyed watching this video thanks for watching